I'm sure you've seen street dogs in India. If you have, you're probably thinking, OMG, those dirty, vile, rabid creatures that haunt the streets at night and prey on the small and weak. Well, it's true, street dogs do cause a lot of problems and have earned themselves a bad name. The street dog problem is a big one, but the truth is, there are some very easy and simple solutions too. Street dogs are a big problem in India. They attack the small and the weak. Any creature that cannot run from these street dogs will be outrun and overpowered. This means that children and the elderly are very vulnerable to uneasy targets for street dogs. All of these factors add up to 80,000 Indians bitten a year. Not only do street dogs bite people, they also transmit deadly diseases. The worst of those diseases is rabies. Rabies is transmitted from dog to human via a bite. That means all those bites add up to 20,000 deaths per year caused by rabies. Rabies is a killer disease that lives in the dog's saliva. It is given to a human via a bite when saliva comes in contact with our blood. Once the disease is in our body, the rabies travels to the brain following the peripheral nerves. Once the rabies reaches the central nervous system and the symptoms begin to show, the infection is virtually untreatable. But there is hope. There are many easy solutions that you could do as soon as you go home. Even though you're probably too scared to go and interact with these street dogs now, you'd be surprised how easily a street dog can be befriended. If you give a street dog a little bit of love, it could become a man or woman's best friend. Once you befriend your dog, you can take it to the veterinarian so it can be spayed or neutered. These days, most veterinarians don't charge to spay or neuter stray dogs because NGOs pay for the dogs to be spayed or neutered for free. When you spay or neuter a dog, it makes a dog unable to breed and have more puppies. Once the process is complete, they will have their ear clipped to mark they have been spayed or neutered. Also, before you take a stray dog to the vets, you should make sure you trust the dog enough to put it in your car to the veterinarians. Or, you can call this number to contact AID, a street dog shelter, to have someone for the veterinarians come pick them up and spay them for you. If you want to eradicate rabies from dogs, you can also take your befriended street dog or dogs to the veterinarians yearly to vaccinate them from rabies and other dangerous diseases. You can also ask for them to be treated for fleas and ticks so they're completely disease free. To conclude, I believe that in short simple steps that everyone does, we can solve this problem. Even if some of you hate dogs or are really scared of them, just call this number so that veterinarians can come and vaccinate the dogs near you. Someday, there will be a stray dog-free deli.